Hello there, it's Courtney and today I'm off to Hotel Anfield for the launch of a clothing line. Now, does anyone know who my favourite player is? <laughs> if you've been on my channel long enough, you'll definitely know that is Kostas Simakos, the Greek scouser. And today he is launching his clothing line, which a percentage of the proceeds does go to charity and he's chosen the Owen McVeigh Foundation, which for anyone who's aware of it, they sort of help out children with cancer and sort of give them amazing memories and that which is an amazing thing to do and an amazing charity and um, definitely go and check them out if you get the chance i will link a page to their charity in the description below but yeah costas is launching his clover line today and i'm going to hotel and field for the launch of it and i'm going to get to meet him so that's pretty cool um but yeah, I thought I'd bring you along. Redman TV are going to be there. James Pierce is going to be there. Obviously, the Ragamuffins going to be there because it's not a hotel and field party without the Ragamuffins. Um, and yeah, obviously, Costas will be there. So it's going to be fun. I'm going to like, it's going to be really interesting to hear what he has to say because I think he is doing like a little talk about it. So that's going to be really cool. It's going to be really cool to see the products in person. Now, I've bought a cap. Um, and on the cap back of the cap, I know it says the Greek Scouts and that, and I thought, perfect when I go on holiday. Because um, I go on holiday to Greece each year, usually. And last time I went, I had a Liverpool top on, and someone just randomly started singing the Syracuse song, and then when they walked past us, they looked back, and so I had Simi's name on the back, and they were like, oh my God. So I think the hat's just going to top off my look when I'm on holiday. But yeah, that being said, I'm going to head to Hotel Anfield now. It's also the World Cup final today, so I might check that out while I'm there. But yeah, it's going to be a fun day. Um, I can't wait for it. I've known about this for a while and I'm really excited about it. So it's like, it's going to be a fun day. Um, I can't wait to see everyone as well. Like I said, it's the World Cup breaks being mental. And therefore, I feel like I've missed everyone. Obviously not got to say, Merry Christmas, have a good new year, everyone. So I get to say that this... Um, this event, so that being said, let's go. To be honest, as a player, always uh, we need uh, a couple of times, a couple of days to, to day off. But after, after we always were thinking uh, we want to come back to play football. Uh, the thing we did for for from the kids. Uh, to be honest, uh, the weather was a little bit better than here. It was a little bit warmer than here. But okay, we miss we miss this place. We miss uh, our castle, uh, Anfield, and uh, we really really. Looking forward to come back and to play in front of uh, our fans. And I guess the message from the manager must have been, despite it being a difficult first half of the season in some ways, there's still so much to play for. Yes, of course, we, we didn't start as we wanted, from, uh, uh, but all the boys, they saw uh, uh, the passion we had uh, on this uh, break, uh, how much we wanted to, to come back, because we, we really didn't, didn't lose anything. So all the boys who were here who were there so passionate to, to give absolutely everything to to working to train very hard uh, and the future uh, I think would be pride for us and uh, and uh, everybody we can achieve uh, our personal and uh, team goals. Well, uh, what they mean to you and their part in your life? Yes, uh, completely everything about my life. It's very, very sensitive uh, picture. This I, I, I choose to put uh, on my my t-shirts or my hoodies. Uh, hopefully, the the people love it because uh, really the the dogs can change you the the life. For me, is uh, absolutely everything. I think without them, uh, uh, I will not be here because always uh, when I was angry about the trainings, about the games, always. They were there, uh, very, very happy for me to and, and help me to, to forget all the all the sad uh, moments I had in my life. So obviously I took another dog. I have three now, and uh, hopefully in the next uh, designs I will put uh, I will put uh, the new one in. What's up, dogs? Then that's gone. You focus on the next game. Then you focus on the next one. That's the way it's always been with Liverpool. Um, and the press goes Say me, say me, I can't, I see me, can't Pass, possess, you speak, you'll be on
Back home now, and that event was amazing. It was amazing to hear from Simicras and John Aldridge about like getting us questions and that. Simi, the launch I think it went so well. There was like two hundred odd people in Anfield, in the hotel Anfield, um, and there was just a really good turn off for it. And I made up for the Owen McFay Foundation and Simi because obviously it's raised a lot of funds for the Owen McFay Foundation, and Simi got to see the support guests from the Scousers, which is awesome. Um, but yeah, listen to what Aldridge and Simi had to say. It was really cool getting an insight into being a footballer for Liverpool. Um, Simi did tell a little story about what we got asked about why his dogs are on the designs and like obviously they play a big part in his life. And he basically said the amount of love they show him and that made me quite emotional because I used to have a Sharpe and obviously now I've got my dad's girlfriend's dog Tilly and like I sort of understood, understood what he was saying. So um, that made me a little bit like, oh, because Sushi My Sharpe was absolutely lovely and amazing. She was like my little best friend. But yeah, it was just really nice hearing that side of things from him and how he was just wanting to like raise money for the community as well was really nice. Um, yeah, like I said, massive tear. Now I got to meet him and get pictures. I've also got something coming up for a giveaway. So within the new year, keep an eye out for it obviously you might be able to guess what it is but i'm not going to announce it in here in the new year though do keep an eye out because i'm going to mark the football coming back with a bang mark my birthday with a bang and start the new year with a bang so keep an eye out for that but it was really good met a few people that i am good mates with like red men um yeah it was just a really cool event but i will put the pictures in with simmy now So yeah, as you can see, I was really happy to meet Simi, um, my favourite player. I had to tell him about the story about when I go to Skiafos. There is, um, well, last time there was a Man United fan who spotted me in the Liverpool top. And even he mentioned the Greek Scouser to me and said, you have a Greek player, he's the Greek Scouser. And I was like, Simi. So that was pretty cool. Um, and I got a video from my little brother who was absolutely made up for it. I sent him it and got to watch his reaction and it was pretty cute. So massive thank you to Simi for that event and Hotel Anfield. They know how to put an event on. Having the ragamuffins on was really good. Um, just the whole setup for it, they had like, it was just really cool the way they done it and it made up for them as well because having Simi there is just really cool. And they, they're just really good people in there. Every match day, I really enjoy being in Hotel Anfield, as you just know, because never all the time um but yeah i've just i'm sort of lost for words off today because it's just been a really nice like start of the christmas period for us um obviously it's got me in the mood now for thursday thursday i cannot wait to watch us play city hopefully soon we start that'd be nice to say um uh, but it would just be really nice to end christmas on a high there too <laughs> but yeah i can't wait for the football to come back now so yeah it's been a really good day like i said so simmy's line is called kt21 um i will link it all in the description and i'll link it in the top corner whichever corner it is um but yeah go and check them out because they are some really cool designs i got a cap um which i'll show you now so this is the cap i got which is the greek scouser it is a really nice cap i cannot wait to be wearing this on holiday and at the match um, but yeah, you've got very nice hoodies. I think I'm going to get a hoodie in the new year, hopefully. Um, but yeah, it's... Like I said, money goes to charity. You're wearing Greek Scouts merch. Love it. Um, yeah, it's just been a really cool day. <laughs> like I said, I'm just rambling now because I've just... It's like a bit of a blur. But that being said, see you all next time, which should be Thursday for the Man City game. Bye. <laughs> There's not a soul out there
Oh, oh, oh. 